Welcome to the Dust of Hollow with the Cut. <laughs> I feel like that was slightly a little racist, even though I'm Japanese myself. Hey guys, and welcome to the Daiso haul. I am gonna show you everything I got at Daiso. I was just feeling like kind of down and blue one day, and I'm like, let's go to one of my favorite stores. No, not Target. Not Target for the first time, because I spend way too much money at Target, and I wanted something cheap that's like my crack addiction, something that's good but cheap. Like Taco Bell, but we didn't go to Taco Bell. We went to Daiso, did some retail therapy. So I got like this giant bag of Daiso things. Daiso is a Japanese dollar store here in California. It's also in Texas and Washington. So I'm so sorry for everyone else in the US and around the world that don't have Daiso because it is magical. It is so much better than the regular dollar store things because they have things there that you wouldn't even imagine you needed or that existed. Like they have like this fake banana thing with like these little line cuts in it and you like just go like this on the banana and it cuts it all into perfectly the same shapes and they have like I don't know they have like things that hold your boots up in place they have like just the weirdest random things you never know they need I got the, the weirdest random thing I got that's not in this haul was like they have these little tiny like kawaii fruit cartoon stickers and you stick them on the inside of your refrigerator and they deodorize your refrigerator like I didn't know I needed this, but I need it. So I bought those, and I bought all of these today. So we're gonna go through them today. I'm so excited about this first thing because it's so cute. Everything there is very girly and cute, and a lot of the theme is pink, but they do have guy stuff there. They do have a gardening section, a pet section, a pottery, like, kitchenware section. They have so many things. I love going to get socks there randomly, but I saw these little cute cartoons of tissue paper and they come with two four six eight ten things of tissue paper and why wouldn't you want to blow your nose into my best little friends with a little bee and a cute little bear why wouldn't you want to blow your nose into have a nice dream with this little rabbit on a moon holding a baby rabbit and let's sing the frog the sea in the sea with little fishies and the penguins and happy bath time with the hippo huh it's so cute they even have like they have a whole aisle of just like erasers that are shaped like animals and food. It's just like, why wouldn't you want it? I also got this coin purse. The coin purse has a little bow and it's polka dot black and white and it reminds me of Sephora and I don't know why this reminds me of Sephora, but it's like a perfectly circle shape that you put your coins in. And it's just so cute. Another thing I got at Daiso is cord wraps that are in alligator, hippo, and bear form and you like, for your cords, like your iPhone or your phone charger cord, you wrap it around it. Your headphones, you wrap it around it. I like these because I lose the small ones and these are nice, like the size of the palm of your hands and they're foam, so they're good for like small children that have iPads because those exist. There's children with iPads that like literally blew my mind to a million pieces. So even children can have these and like, look, so your cord won't get messy with a television. Can you see that little thing they have there? I can't read Japanese and I can barely speak it only when I want to order food. But they do have some English on here. It is so cute. Speaking of animals, I saw this little treasure chest of elephants. I'm like, you could put stuff into this. I want it. And I'm like, this is so cute. So it has a little latch and like little treasure chest of elephants. It's so adorable. Like, why wouldn't you want this? I'm going to spend my life away. I die so. Again, cute animals. My friend Chelsea, who did a Daiso haul with me on this channel, she got this in white, and I was looking for the white one, but I saw this pink one, and they look like, I call them like little boob bunnies, which is weird, I know, but it just looks like, I don't know, it just like looks so pathetic and fat and cute, and I love like these little fat animal cute things, and it's a bank by, by means, and you put your little money in it, and he has a little hole to take the money out. To. I love it. We should give you a name. We will do it at the end of the video. Another thing I got because I love the bath time things at Daiso and I absolutely love like these things right here and they're long towels that are super soft and they like suds up your soap so you get like your back and like behind your neck and your ears and stuff and it just like is so soft and it actually scrubs very well and I always buy a ton of these and then I saw this guy there and he's like a little panda bear mitten sponge for your bath time like why wouldn't you want a little mitts and then you just scrub your it's so cute and just everything there's so cute and everything here is a dollar fifty did i say that 
Everything's $1.50. Some stuff isn't $1.50 and it's marked and has a sticker like some will be like $3 to $5. I haven't seen anything there over $5 and I don't think I have. Maybe they do. Who knows? And I told you about the socks. I had to get these because, I mean, they match my outfit. And they're Tim Burton. I love stripes, like black and white stripes because it reminds me of Tim Burton. And they got little blue, royal blue bows on the back of them. And little rufflies. Like, these are so adorable. Like, $1.50 for these socks. And their socks are very high quality. Like, the Target socks and the Forever 21 socks bust on me more than the Daiso ones. I saw this little wavy panda keychain. I'm like, I need this. Why do I want this? It's a, it was the last one. I think that's why. And I'm like, you're the last one. You need a home. I'm going to give you a home. And I saw this and I thought it would be perfect for like lipsticks and just to hold makeup in. I love that it's just white and it has florals and it's very gaudy and it looks like a princess should own this. This reminds me of like a container for Polly Pockets but more whimsical and cool. I don't know why, but it does. We're going to sound like an infomercial on three, two, one. Need to clean your house? Well, today we have the Bunny Rabbit Scrubber. The Bunny Rabbit Scrubber is mica fiber with very high technology, little squiggly pasta looking things that pick up all your dust. And for only two payments of free 99 you could own this Bunny Rabbit today. I just think this is so cute, first of all. I have one of these and you could like hang it on like a doorknob or something or like a little hook in your house and it cleans like it's good for like computers and stuff. I just like love this. Okay, remember earlier in the video I told you that they had little erasers that are in the shapes of food and animals? Well, I had to get this because it's an animal of a monkey, a unicorn, and a koala. And I'm like, oh, why not get that? It's so cute. And I got a whole bunch of other things. So they have a whole stationary section. I'm like, Floral, let's get the floral notebook. And I only got one notebook. This one's lined paper and it's just a great size and it's so, so cute. If I was at school, I'd want to write in this. But I also got this one that's an alpaca. Look at his face and look, he has a little butt in the back. Oh my gosh. And these are also little lined papers and this would be so good for journaling and it's so cute. Look at his face. It's like, I am a sleeping little alpaca. He's just so. So cute, so yeah, I got these two. And I had to get stickers. They had like these 3D floral stickers with ladybugs and snails, and I'm like, I want this. Like for everyday planning life. And then these are some of my favorite stickers. They have this, which is like, they have for tabs, and it says, I love you, happy, sweet love. And they have cupcakes on it. And I like these for like tabbing places in a book or in your, what I use them for is like for planning everyday stuff. Or what I also use them for is video editing and I put them on my screen. If you've seen tape on my computer when I post on Snapchat, that's what that's for. And then these little guys are more little pandas and bears and piggies and frogs and bears of like little tabs that are like this, but they're like little animals. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Oh, and I got fruit erasers. I totally forgot about these, but they're cherries, grapes, and a peach. Because I had to get it because peach, natural peach is my friends. And the peach palette, which is awesome. And I did get some pencils and pens. I got these awesome pencils. You guys remember these pencils? They were like back in the 90s where they had like, you, once you like run out of lead, you take that and put it at the other end. You can't, the only thing is that sucks is you can't lose the lead, but this one has eight of them in it and they're all different cool colors. But you just like get a new piece of lead every time and put it in the back of it. It sounds confusing, but it's not once you get it. And then... They had scented markers, and this one scented like orange and strawberries, grapes, bananas, and melon. And I just thought these were such pretty like colors, and I wanted to sniff them. And they're aram aromatic fluorescent pins, and they remind me of gel pins, but they're not. And I saw this like king and queen looking like very colorful like pins, and I thought they were so cute because they have crowns on it. Like, why wouldn't you want a pin with a crown? Like, I'm king or queen of the world. And to hold all the pins and pencils, I got this cute little monster face pencil case. And it looks like a beach duffel bag with a monster face on it. Like, why wouldn't you want this? And last but not least, the most random thing ever I got is this. And it's a fly swatter. And you have to like, this is how you load it. And then to get the flies, you're like, it sounds dangerous, but it's not. Like, like it doesn't hurt me or anything. But it's just so random and so cool this looks so fun this reminds me of those like 90s toys where you just like the little grabbers but to actually have a function and grab flies a round of applause 
I just think this is so, so cool. I don't know why. Maybe I'm the only one. I absolutely love, like, helping people get flies out of their house. I know that sounds very morbid in, like, killing flies, but oh, this is so satisfying, just the sound. So that is everything I got from Daiso, and surprise, surprise, we're going to do a giveaway. These are not all things that I bought for myself. I actually went there intention to pick up my favorite things to buy for you guys, one of you guys to win. The contest will end the end of May 10th. Let's pick that. I don't know when this video is going to go out, but let's pick May 10th. I know it's going to go out before May 10th. So you have till May 10th to go to rafflecopter.com. The link will be down below, the first link there, where you can enter your email address, and I'll tell you ways to like tweet, Facebook, different things to enter the contest. I think you can only enter once. I'm pretty sure. And I will randomly pick someone through Rafflecopter. I'll pick someone at random to send all of these goodies to, especially this little guy. We still need to name him. So leave a comment on what we should name this little, my favorite little fet repped guy of a piggy bank. This is going to be international as well. I've got to say of all ages. I mean, I don't know if a guy would want like frilly bow socks or anything, but I mean, be you. If I was a guy, I would still wear frilly bow socks. Guys and girls could enter this is what I'm trying to say. And I hope someone just gets this and it makes them cheerful, even though it's stuff from like a Japanese dollar store. I know it's not everywhere, so I'll, I just want you guys to enjoy it too, because it's like just such fun, weird, quirky, cool things. And I know some of the people could use the supplies of the stationery for school and everything. So again, the link to the giveaway is the first one in the description box below. Again, you will have till May 10th to enter this giveaway and be at your computers on May 10th. It will be around midnight where I start picking the winners. And if you need to make sure that you get that email, because if you don't and you won that contest, I will give you 48 hours. If you do not reply to my email within 48 hours, I have to move on and pick someone else who really wants this prize. So be at your computers May 10th and good luck to everybody who enters. Hope you guys had fun hanging out with me today and going through all the Japanese haul stuff. I love you guys, and I will definitely see you soon. Bye!